31st Street between Fairlawn and Wanamaker in Topeka might have noticed more green traffic lights. That's because the city has placed a real-time traffic signal system on a few busy roadways. 27 News reporter Monica Castro hit the streets to test out what's being called the Green Light Tunnel. That's right, I did, and I hit almost all green lights on Wanamaker, except on 21st Street. Going to Fairlawn, I stopped at a few. I even talked to motorists that said they noticed that traveling on 21st, there was less congestion. It would be wonderful to not have to stop so frequently. For motorists traveling on 21st between Wanamaker and Fairlawn, they may be witnessing more green lights, but it's not just by luck. The city put in a real-time traffic signal system, which puts cars in a green light tunnel. For one motorist, she might actually stop avoiding Wanamaker on Friday evenings. So if this changes that, I certainly would probably go there more often during those times. Other drivers appreciate the city for putting in this system because it reduces driving frustrations. And I think it'll make traffic go a lot smoother, a lot faster. You won't have the green light, red light, green light, red light, which is really annoying. Traffic engineer Linda Voss said the city was able to put the real-time traffic system in because of an energy and conservation grant it received. Energy is a huge issue. When you're sitting at a red light, you're burning gas and you're emitting pollutants into the atmosphere. That was one of the main things about this project since we were getting energy money that we showed that we were eliminating pollutants and also saving gas. Boss thinks another benefit drivers will have, besides less stops and traveling time being cut, is creating a safer driving environment. Along 21st Street, just from Fairlawn to Wanamaker, we had about 100 rear-end accidents last year. And we're hoping with drivers not having so much congestion and not having to stop, that it'll have a benefit as far as safety is concerned as well. Voss explains by using cameras and processors, the intersections are able to talk to each other to coordinate traffic. The software is able to adjust signals to minimize delay. Monica Castro, 27 News. All right, thanks, Monica. The schedule for Topeka Boulevard will be determined when they install equipment to 45th Street.